I figure I start this little segment called would you recommend it on my channel for the new year I'm trying to get new things I keep on flashing the product so now you know what the product I'm going to talk about but the product that I'm going to be talking about is the naked three palette wait let me find the freaking brush okay so one moment though it looks like this it's rose gold and then inside the box was the naked three palette and then there were four of the well all of the urban decay 24 7 primer potions original eden anti-aging and sin and it comes like this it's basically a week's worth of eyeshadow primer but when you open up the naked palette it's hard actually to so great for traveling so when you open it it has this big mirror and you can fold it all the way back I guess they thought about YouTube tutorials with that so it comes with this brush mine is dirty because I just used it and it's just like a flat like a flat packing brush and uh, this brush I would use like to pack the color on my outer V double-sided and some I have a love-hate relationship with double-sided brushes because when you wash them it's like you're washing them and then you flip it over and it's like the water Ugh. anywho and this is what the palette looks like really nice it has two four six eight ten twelve colors and okay from it's strange Okay, Strange Dust Burnout Limit Buzz Trick. Nooner, Liar, Factory, Mugshot, Dark Side, and Black Heart. Okay, Black Heart kinda, well I'm not gonna say kinda because it does. It reminds me of, um, one second. Black Heart, it reminds me of Beauty Mark by MAC. Except Beauty Marked is a bit darker, but as far as pigmentation goes, Black Heart. Yeah, Black Heart wins. This is Black Heart. This is Beauty Marked. I'll give you a close up. side by side this one it looks like it would be more pigmented than this because it looks darker but black heart it wins so yeah it has beautiful colors they are all rose toned um, I think this is the perfect 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 palette if you're a freelance makeup artist and you have a wedding like any and every color you can need from a bride who wants nothing to a bride like me who will be extremely dramatic and wants a freaking smoky cut crease like you never like you never know when it comes to a bride and it's just like you're with bridal it's like beauty makeup you're enhancing but um I feel like this is the perfect palette it's great for traveling comes with a brush and you can, you know, close this, put it in your suitcase. It won't get ruined because, you know, with traveling, your makeup could get crushed. And I also have a way to protect your makeup while traveling. So give this video a thumbs up if you want to see that. And, um, yeah, so would I recommend it? I would most, most definitely recommend it. Whether you're a freelance makeup artist or you're just, you know, regular a regular gal on the street and you're like, hey, you know, should I get this Naked 3 palette? I definitely think you should get it. It is totally worth the $52. Um, I got mine for Christmas. I'm so, I was so happy when Mike got this for me. But the colors, like the formulation, they are like so smooth. Like they blend like, oh, uh, it's like they spread like butter. They blend like you're freaking mixing cake batter. Like it, when I mean this palette, you cannot go wrong. You have like your, your highlights to your, you know, dark 
smoke smoking out colors you have a really dark brown instead of a black i like that and i also like how they have a champagne like a champagne color a rose gold color and a regular gold color in the palette um there are one two three four five six. wait there are only one two three four matte colors in the palette everything else is shimmer so if you're like i don't think like the shimmer is like a you know a big deal because it's not like you know chunks of glitter it's like it's refined and it's just it's amazing like go get it yes i would recommend you to go get it like i don't know there's nothing more for me to say but just to go um purchase this like one of my friends she told me that it was limited edition i'm not sure of that so if you know if it's limited edition or not comment that below and you know make sure you run out and get it go to they sell it at macy's sephora and the urban decay website and of course you know the other like you know beauty retailers that hold like ulta that holds urban decay products so yeah um hopefully you enjoyed this video and there'll be more like this so have a great day and if you live in the new york city area go outside with your children and go play in the snow but yeah um have a great day and i'll see you next time bye